Within the small building behind Mentory Hall lies the undocumented resource center. Here, butterflies line the walls. And while these butterflies aren't migrating anytime soon, they stand for something greater. Dreams of a brighter future. One filled with resilience and hope within the immigrant community. We're always building, right? Because we want students to not have to struggle as much and have access so they can just be students. There's so many layered identities when you're undocumented and there's so many obstacles, um, like huge obstacles. Doesn't have to struggle, they don't have to feel alone, like they're the only ones, because I remember that feeling. It seemed like it was unattainable for me because I thought that there weren't like any college opportunities for undocumented students in high school. So I didn't have anywhere to go in high school, so I didn't think that college was for me. There's a lot of racism that's still very real, and we you know there, there's things that we have to talk about, right, as well. So for a student who is in fear or who doesn't want to identify openly, right, about being undocumented, we hear you and we see you. For an undocumented student, the pathway to citizenship, well, it's incredibly intimidating. And who can blame them? I mean, just think of all the things that they have to go through all the necessary paperwork they have to file in order to be just considered for citizenship. All their schoolwork, uh, if they're working a job, if they're the sole provider for their family, and well, most importantly, the last one, the ever-increasing fear of having you or a loved one being taken away at any given moment. Frankly, this whole situation, well, sometimes it feels as if well, it feels as if you're the only one going through it. But, luckily for us, those at the Undocumented Resource Center want to make sure that whatever journey or migration you're going on, you're not going through it by yourself. We want to help you look for the resources that you have because you do have opportunity and there is a future for you here and you are welcomed here, not just here at TOC, but here in the United States, you know, there's so many doors for you to open and and even though like they feel they're closed, we're going to help you open those doors and like uh, help you find those doors, those opportunities that are there for you. And I just want everybody to know that uh, I'm here for them. I'm here for you. Um, and in general, just um, we're all just here for you and we want to listen and we want to um, help you achieve your goals. For Canyons News, I'm George Luis Aguila.